and boom, we are rolling. What's going on, guys? Welcome in. Take a seat and get comfortable. Hope you're having an absolutely magical day so far. It's great to have you all here. Hope you're all keeping safe and well. So on today's video, we're going to be checking out a band called Magin, and specifically, we're going to be checking out their latest track, which came out about about two months ago which is called transcend so massive fan of Magin. this will be the third time that i've had them on the uh had them on the channel i've done reaction videos to their tracks binary incantation and sirens um i've listened to um all of their stuff a good number of times but despite that um Whenever I'm getting geared up to um, to do a reaction video for a band, I like to go back to the beginning, get my hands on everything that I can, listen to everything from the from the oldest to the newest, just to you know, so I can talk, you know, so sort of got interesting things to say. Just you know, just it's also just really interesting as well, you know, just to see like you know how the bands progressed and what they sounded like, if they've changed that much, what's got better, what's got worse, so on and so forth. So went back um, 2020, uh, their debut EP uh, Warpath. Um, I've written here. Alpha Wolf ish, very Alpha Wolf vibes um, th throughout their music. They've got an Alpha Wolf style um, swag to them. Um, r much heavier vocals than Alpha Wolf and bands like kind of like maybe they don't sound that much like Varials, but yeah, yeah, um, Alpha Wolf much more like deathcore on the spectrum when it, of um, of heavy vocals and this guy. I mean, almost over delivers. Like he's always doing kind of like shit that sounds like nothing else you've heard. They're powerful. They're well done. Is an absolute beast of a vocalist. Um, lots of futuristic vibes. Lots of chugs. Um, some tracks sound like they would be on a modern day Doom game. I've literally written Doom vibes, but not Doom metal. Um, huge choruses. Um, and then I've literally written again really good vocals. It's just it's just every every track. Whenever this guy gets any uh, gets any gets any space to move, is just madness. Just, just such an underrated vocalist. Um, so then they released a track in 2020 called "Marked for Death." Uh, very similar. Could have been on the Warpath EP, but quite a bit more sinister. Um, then they release a track called "Night City Drift." Um, basically, the only way I can describe it is it's got kind of Asian Tokyo style vibes to it. Lots of car sounds going on in the background. Amazing vocals again, awesome outro, much more sinister. Um, Sirens has a, and then Sirens, Binary, Binary Incantation and Argent Cell, all kind of like, you know, kind of, there's, there's a, they've definitely brought on some more trub, trub, oh my God, boomer, boomer alert, um, dub um, slash trap. Uh, vibes to their music and a lot more Asian influence because we're going to listen to a track by these guys called um, Devil Transformation, which comes off the same album as Transcend, which is called District Violet. I'm going to so I've, I've heard two tracks off that, but we're going to do a full reaction to the to the EP at some point, so we'll get three new bonus bonus tracks there. Um, but yeah, Devil Transformation, just to let you know what what these guys are, are up to at the uh, at the at the moment. But it's it, nothing else quite sounds like uh, sounds like Magin. Um, so 2022, uh, the Mechanics of Suffering. That's a split EP with another band that I really like called Dreadworm. Go check that out. That's got little that that that's got influences of both of them so it's it, it's not a standalone work basically it sounds very different than everything else they've they've they've, they've made 2022 obsidian sky um trap glitchy intro uh, some cleans on this one also along with some blast beats which i think quite interesting so the cleans come from a guy called i can only presume is louis uh louis salvi or savvy, I'm not quite sure how to say that name. Um, so clean vocals aren't um, like usually part of uh, Majin's uh, repertoire. That was more of like a kind of like guest vocalist type thing, but they work really, really fucking good. Um, and then I've got Devil Transformation, Trap Asian Vibes is the only way I can describe it because it actually features two Asian um, rappers. Um, and it sounds like Asian Suicide Boys, but mixed in with like with some heavier elements. And it's just it, I've had such a good time researching these guys. Um, been a while since I'd listened to their to their to their back catalog. So yeah, it was a it was a lot of fun. So let's check out Devil Transformation, and then let's uh, yeah let's get on to uh, let's go on to Transcend. So Devil Transformation, let's go. Nope, nope. There we go. Uh, 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 
Imagine are so underrated, dude. So seriously, criminally underrated. Is but it's it's brutal. Such a good song, man. Fusing other genres together, man. It's just love it. Absolutely love it. So fucking cool. So heavy as well. Doesn't doesn't scrimp on the heaviness in any way. Um, absolutely love it. So let's um let's get into this. Let me just get. Right, pen, paper, take some notes, okie dokie, transcend, imagine, let's, uh, let's do this.
So fucking good, dude. So fucking good. Transcend. Magin. Um, oh, I fucking love Magin. I just, I, I love them. I love them so much, man. I love them so much. Um, they've just got themselves listed as a deathcore band here. And I mean, I think the deathcore tag, it, it's, it suits them in many ways. At some points, they sounded very, very almost black and deathcore there, but there's a, there's, there's, it's the, it's the, the glitchy, um, aspect to the music, the electronic bits to the music, the bits where they sound again very much like Alpha Wolf, that kind of push these guys. And I wouldn't call them metalcore. I don't know if I would call them hardcore. Maybe modern metalcore with deathcore or something in there. It's just a, a very very interesting mix. Um, and um, yeah, let's let's get let's get straight into it. Um, Thirty seconds in, I've got a bit that I want to highlight. <laughs> Just for a moment, they almost sound like Bring Me the Horizon. I'm just going to keep it playing because there's some vocals coming up that I want to highlight. Just, he... He could get away with just having a decent mid, maybe a bit of a screech and a slight tunnel throat or something, and that would that he would do fine in this band. But just every every track, he just he just oh, yeah, almost over delivers. It's so crazy. He could go straight into like a like a full on symphonic blackened deathcore band or a slamming deathcore band, and have. Absolutely n no problems whatsoever. Um, it's mad. This chorus is so cool as well. Just a very, very unusual use of um, of sound effects. Let's uh, let's check it out. I 
let's listen to them again. So like like really really audible in the mix as well. Sometimes you have to really really strain your ears to hear the ambience in deathcore, or whatever you want to call this. Um, but not the case there. Cut through really really well. You didn't have to didn't have to like properly like you know like focus your hearing to hear like the, the hear the sound effects there. Just cut through really really clean. Just v very unusual, man. Very unusual. Love it. So this is the this is what separate another thing that separates these guys from like other like deathcore bands. Just they, they just throw sections in like this. And see, it, it, it sound effects like that. I'm just going to keep this playing because there's some monstrous vocals coming up in about 30 seconds. Like just, just that th those breeze are gnarly. <laughs> Such an interesting sound and high as well. Like it's not quite, it's not quite whistle tone. But like it's like very very high register. Um, again, just man could could do so much less and still be doing a great job. But just all this crazy, yeah, just just craziness. Um, I fucking loved that. I thought that was amazing. Um, I really do. Um, I'm always impressed with these guys. Um, always always impressed with these guys. Um, how inventive they are. How heavy they are. Um, how how great the mixes sound like even like on their very first EP Warpath like they they had the mix down and it sounds even better now if that's um, if that's possible um, yeah so much so much so much cool glitchy interference um, so many it's just in, interesting interesting vibes um, cuts away and has like a you know a distorted voice going with some like kind of like like, like can like kind of almost like drum and bass trappy sounding. 
um, drums, like drum effects and stuff, just like thrown in there. Um, and that's on the back of Devil Transformation as well, which was completely different from that. Um, I cannot wait to hear District Violet, man. Those other three songs are going to be insane. They're going to throw in something interesting on, on every every track, I imagine. Um, yeah, just so inventive and so fucking cool. Just another amazing band from the UK. Uh, what can I say? Where are these guys from? Um, Southampton. Yeah, so England. Um, seriously impressive. Seriously, seriously impressive stuff. Yeah, I don't have a, don't have a bad word to say about that. I really, really don't. So, as per usual... Links will be uh, down below to the song that we just heard, the Slam Worldwide uh, video. There'll be links to their social medias, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, blah, 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 blah. Go and follow them and all of them. Help them out with the algorithm. Leave a comment, follow, subscribe, turn on bell for notifications, do all that, do, do all that social media stuff. Order some merchandise. I know times are tough and like you know everything's really expensive, but if you fancy splashing out on some merch, that would really help these guys. Try and get out to see them play live. I'm going to do the same thing as well. A um, little bit of a journey. I'm in Scotland, so they're, they're like a little bit further down the country. So it, it could take some take some doing, but we we get it done. Um, links to where you can stream all the music, get their numbers up. Just do whatever you can to support these guys because they're just the 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 so unique, so interesting. Um, totally doing their own thing. Love the image. Love the love the style. Love the work ethic. Love the music videos. Just massive fan. Have, have been for years and will continue to be for, for, for many more. So one more time, imagine, transcend. Um, absolutely fucking loved that. Hope you guys did too. I'm 99.9% sure you guys uh, got as much of a kick out of that as I did. So um, yeah, thank you very much for joining me once again. Take it easy. Always a pleasure. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. <laughs>